Hey guys, it's Madame Morio. Welcome back to more Animal Crossing Diaries. Today I want to talk about some of the events that have happened in my town because I've had a lot of visitors lately. I've had Sahara, I've had Katrina, I've had some other dude I don't even remember the name of anymore. I've had Katie, I've had... Uh, just everyone's going to my town. Crazy Red, there have been so many people in town. So I wanted to talk about the functions of these people and what they do. Talked about Katie a little bit before. You take her to another town. I did hear back, she sent you a letter the next day saying, oh my god, thank you for helping me explore the world, and then she gives you a gift. In my case, it was a globe. I don't know if it's the same for everybody, that kind of makes sense, so I would assume it is, but I don't know. Sahara is really unique this time, and I really like her function a lot better than in previous games. Before, it was go out, collect old wallpaper from your neighbors, you had to get like three or something like that and then you would give those wallpapers to her and she would ex exchange them for one that she had. Now it's a little bit different because you pay 3,000 bells, she goes into your house, and she gives you a brand new carpet and a brand new wallpaper and puts it on the wall and then she gives you back whatever was on the wall previously or the floor. And it's, I love that function, that's so cool. It's like a surprise, like just for, you know, telling Sahara, go to my house, look at my furniture and do this, and I happen to get some carpet that I really love and wall that I can use later. So I was pretty excited about it. I was pretty satisfied with that feature. Now the guy I can't remember the name of because it was something weird and it reminded me of Bieber and I was like, I don't want to think of Justin Bieber when I think of this guy. I don't know. But he is a new character. I'll have a picture of him at the end of this video. And what he does is he comes in, you talk to him, and he will give you badges for accomplishments you've made within the game. For instance, I have two badges right now. I can actually pull them up right now. And they go on your travel card. And mine just happens to be an insect maniac, which means I've caught 50% of all the bugs in the game. And then I also have a seafood maniac because I've caught all the seafood in the game. Not really, but I wish. I'm only missing 12 seafood. <laughs> so I've caught at least 50% and I think that's a really cool feature because then you can look at that on other people and see how addicted to the game they are compared to you. Katrina I got some wicked pictures from. I love the pictures I got from her fortune telling. Right now she just tells you your fortune, tells you what kind of item is going to be involved in your fortune. You know, it's kind of the same as always, except you're not tripping over your feet and falling on your face like in previous games. And then I talked about Red before. He's back in his tent. You can only get one item from him per visit, and it could be a fake painting. Mine was. But that doesn't mean it will be, so at least try, because you can't get more than one thing from him, and it is sent to your house, so that's kind of interesting. Uh, that's what happened to me. Maybe there's a function where he just gives it to you right then and then you know your painting's not a fake. I also want to encourage you guys because I really love to keep Animal Crossing interactive and as interactive as possible. I really want to encourage you guys to tweet screenshots from your game to me and I will feature them in a future video. Probably pretty soon. I would like to make like a slideshow every week of what people have sent me. Just one each, because I don't want to be like, you know, one person has 20 pictures and another has one. So definitely send me a screenshot of your town. I would love to see it. I'd love to see a cool event that happened, your neighbor, you, your house, whatever. Go ahead and submit those screenshots to me. I'll provide a link in the video description that tells you how to do that, how to submit pictures on Twitter, via your 3DS. So yeah, definitely submit them to me on Twitter, not on here. Just tweet them at me because that is going to be the easiest and I'm going to see them and it's going to be fantastic. Yeah, get on Twitter. I'm twitter.com slash madamorio. That's me. And I'll include that in the video description as well. So you can follow me and tweet your pictures at me because I want to see you guys playing Animal Crossing with me because that's so much fun and I love it. And there's just no reason that this shouldn't be interactive. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, pimps.